welcome everyone. I hope you are having a beautiful day, a beautiful week, a beautiful month. I'd say beautiful year, but this is 2020. I feel like 2020 in hindsight will be beautiful, but right now I feel like it's a year of challenge and growth for a lot of us um, that we'll look back on and be grateful for, but it's been kind of hard to navigate through. <laughs> That's what I'm going to say. Um, but on the topic of growth, I wanted to talk to you guys about something that I'm doing that I'm so freaking excited about. You might not be excited, but that's alright because it's not your life. I'm excited. Um, and I'm just going to be making a personal change. I've been doing a lot of self-reflection and self-evaluating and also visual visualization exercises of, you know, who I want to be who I want to see myself as and what she looks like, you know? I know it sounds cheesy, but kind of doing the affirmation thing where you live and you tell yourself that you want to be this person as if you already are. And that's kind of what I'm going to be taking strides to do. So tomorrow I have an appointment to do just that. Uh, I want to share kind of what sparked this though. I'm turning 25 and it just feels like a really good time to take on a new me type of attitude. I feel like it's just one of those numbers. I'm a quarter way through my life, you know, that's hoping I live to 100. I don't know with technology these days, but I'm turning 25 and it just feels like it's time for me to take my next step and step into the next person I want to be, shed my old self and welcome my new self. So that's exactly what I'm going to do. And I want to take you guys on the journey with me. So I hope you enjoy. Don't leave any hate comments by the time you're done watching this because like I said, it's my own personal decision and it is for myself. I just want to be able to share it with you guys. So keep on watching. Today is the day. I almost couldn't fall asleep last night because I was so excited. It only took rescheduling this two times and it's about a month later <laughs> from the time I originally filmed the intro to this video, but my appointments today, we're about to get a change. So take one last look at this long hair. and I do not even feel bad about it. You guys had a lot of good guesses on what my transformation would be. Everything ranging from getting my girls done to this tattoo to getting something done on my face. Clearly it was none of those. And this was all about my new do that I am obsessed with. I just wanted to share some of my final thoughts to wrap up this video. It's actually been a week since I cut it. I made you guys wait a while. <laughs> And it's been a month since the initial introduction of this video. A long wait, but so, so, so worth it. I'm absolutely obsessed, obsessed with my new hair. If I could put it on a level, you guys. Here's regular obsessed. Here's where I'm at. That's where I'm at with this. 
<laughs> I thought I would be nervous the day that I cut it, but honestly, it was all smiles, all love. I feel like it was way past due. I've been wanting to cut my hair for so long and it took me forever to finally pull the trigger on it and I'm so glad I did. I wanted to explain kind of the feeling that happened with it in case any of you are out there wanting to change something or do something. Just kind of the excitement behind when you pull the trigger on something that you deep down feel like you want to do. After it was chopped, I feel like I literally stepped into who I was meant to be. I feel like I stepped into myself, I felt more confident, I felt more sexy, I felt more fun. And honestly, if there's something you want to do, just pull the trigger and do it for you. Don't let anyone else talk you out of it. Just don't. A lot of people didn't want me to cut my hair, but you know what I did? I cut it anyways, and it feels amazing. I'm so excited for the new look and getting to do a bunch of new things with it. I hope you guys enjoy it and are excited too. If not, <coughs> that's not my problem. But this is how it's going to be. Some short hair. I'll still post some videos on how to do it because we'll be having some fun new do's with this. But I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video of my hair transformation. It was a big deal for me and I was super happy to take you along for the journey. That concludes this video. If you enjoyed, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Don't mind my band-aid. And subscribe so that you don't miss my videos in the future. Bye!